Imagine you're cruising at 35,000 feet, coffee in hand, and someone asks, why don't airplanes hand out parachutes like airline peanuts? The narrator watches cabin passengers, imagine capes, dramatic but impractical. First, modern airliners are like airborne buses, hundreds of people, narrow aisles, luggage, and seat belts. Equipping every passenger with a parachute would require training, proper donning, correct deployment altitude, and body position. Without training, parachutes become elaborate scarves with tragic outcomes. Then there's the physics. At cruising altitude, it's bitterly cold, air is thin, and oxygen is scarce. Jumping without a pressurized suit and oxygen would be like trying to swim the English Channel in a tuxedo. Heroic, brief, deadly. Even if everyone miraculously survived the jump, winds, jet streams, and navigation would scatter people like confetti across an unwelcoming landscape. Now the logistical comedy. Where to store hundreds of parachutes? Under seats? Overhead bins? That reduces cabin space, increases weight, and inflates fuel costs. More weight means fewer flights, higher tickets, and pilots telling you gently that savings were used on socks and parachutes. Budgetary humor aside, statistically, air travel is astonishingly safe. Most emergencies are handled by trained crew, controlled descents and emergency landings, not mass exits. Commercial planes rarely have situations where parachuting passengers is a realistic option. Parachutes save lives in skydiving and military ops designed for individual exit, not in fast-moving, full-capacity jets. Finally, emergency evacuations are surprisingly efficient. Slides, trained crew, and rapid descent to safety on the ground. Regulations, engineering, and economics converge. Fixing the plane, landing, and getting everyone off intact beats scattering humanity across a county. So no, you won't get a parachute with your pretzel. And honestly, that's probably for the best. Sit back, buckle up, and let the professionals handle the drama. Bonus point, flight crews practice for rare emergencies. Technology prevents most failures and aircraft are built to glide, so enjoy the view. Trust the engineers, trust the crew, and maybe skip the cape. Turbulence is dramatic enough. Fly safe.